I'm here to announce the new worship technology coordinator. Uh, the role is responsible for sound projection video production broadcast of our sanctuary in person worship, but also uh, for our live stream. First, I want to extend some thank yous to Linda Bemke, who is the, uh, the head of personnel, also Dave McIntyre, Dave Bellamy, Colin Comstock, and Tim Roykoff for doing interviews and helping us call through all the candidates. I also want to admit that um, early on in the process, Steve did approach us and shared that Matt might be interested in the role. However, I want you all to know we did not hold that against him. Um, actually, it made us look even closer at Matt to ensure he truly was the right person for the role and also for the church. I'm pleased to say he stood far out above all the other candidates in his skills as well as his fit for NPC, both personally and also spiritually. I just want to highlight a few tidbits off his resume before I bring that up. He was a guitarist and a manager for an international touring band, Rosetta, for 17 years, seven albums, 24 tours through 45 countries. Recording and mixing music since 2003, including lots of found wandering concerts. Freelance live sound person since 2008. Campus minister and worship leader at InterVarsity Christian Fellowship at Penn from 2009 to 2012. Worship leader and volunteer coordinator at Woodland Press, 2012 to 2014 and self-employed music electronics repair technician and builder for amps and special effects and recording equipment 2010 to present. I also want to share that I didn't really know Matt that well, but over the last several months, I've gotten to know him. He's highly dedicated, team-spirited, committed to excellence, deep technical abilities, um, excellent problem, problem resolution, um, never gets flustered, and when it comes to sound, Matt is truly gifted. I want to share, Matt can actually hear things that dogs can't hear. Um, most importantly, he is spiritually aligned with MPC's beliefs and core values. So before I bring Matt up, I'd like to ask you to join me in prayer. Father God, we are so grateful to have Matt in his new role and thankful for his longtime connection to NPC, as well as his extraordinary gifts of technology. Lord, we ask that you bless and watch over Matt and his team and work through them by the Holy Spirit to strengthen and grow our worship of you. And may all our efforts glorify you and bring you joy. Amen. Please join me in congratulating Matt Weed on his new role as NPC's Worship Technology Coordinator, reporting to Tim Roykoff. Matt? Thank you, Jack. This is a homecoming of sorts for me, and I wish that it could be in person, but this is the situation that we're in. I, I grew up in this church. I've been a part of it for as many years as my dad. Um, haven't attended here in the last few years because I live in West Philly and have been going to a local church. But uh, even after college, I was a mission cause of this church when I was on staff with InterVarsity Christian Fellowship. So I actually signed on as a temporary contractor back in September just to sort of bridge the gap and uh, help transition into the live streaming setup. We had a lot of new equipment, not a lot of people who knew how to use it, and it just felt like a way that I could contribute to something that I'd cared about. But during that time, I got invested in the mission, and when I found that the church was maybe having some trouble finding some qualified applicants, I decided to apply, and so here I am, and uh, it is a homecoming. We have an absolutely amazing setup in the back, and I am really, really excited about what your generosity as a congregation has allowed us to put together. But now that we have all of that stuff, we need a few people who would be willing to be generous with their time. So we need people to operate cameras, we need people to mix sound for the live stream. We need people to run projections, and we need people to mix sound for the sanctuary, which is an old role that's kind of changed a little bit in transitioning into the new setup. If you have experience with audio, video, broadcast, if you've ever made a YouTube video, if you've ever made a song in GarageBand, you'll have a head start. Might be something that you would enjoy. But if you don't, 
we don't want anybody to exclude themselves from what we're doing based on a lack of experience. Your enthusiasm and your interest is the most important thing, and we can train you. We would love to train you. So if that's something that you would be interested in, I'd love for you to email me. My email address is mweed at narberthprez.org, and I'm looking forward to hearing from you. I think we're going to have a lot of fun. Well, I knew he, uh, he looked familiar to me. And just to confirm what Jack said, Matthew does not report to me, and I don't report to him either. Uh, but I will say as objectively as I can, as his dad, that I do feel great joy, and I am very grateful for the gifts and the spirit that uh, Matthew brings to our worship team and to the Ministry of Technology and to Narberth Presbyterian Church.